Welcome back to another edition of Arkansas Wildman Survival. Gonna have you ride along with me on my trap line today. Didn't catch nothing but a few possums. But it sure is pretty up here today. Enjoyed being running the line with the family. We had fun. Yeah, I think Jan missed the fox, had a worker set, but it didn't step on the trap. That fox would have been pretty in this snow. But it's beautiful up here this morning. Evening. It's 2.48. Here on the line. Well, folks, have you got your stuff prepared for uh, the next four years? I think the economy is going to tank and food prices, gas prices, all that's going to be high. So each time you go to the store, just just grab an extra can of chicken breast or chili or uh, extra bag of beans because uh, before it's all over with, I think you're going to wish you had. Store you some extra water, ammo, but uh, food for sure because I think food prices is fixing to Fixing the skyrocket after January 20th, along with gas and other things. But uh, just some uh, wise advice. Uh, oh, ain't that pretty over there on that mountain? But yeah, trip. Store you some food, some water. Store what you like and rotate it out. You don't have to be a millionaire to prep. Uh, just go to your local dollar store, get some canned food. Me, I, I oven canned stuff, I pressure canned stuff, I buy canned goods, I forage, hunt, fish. So I'm not really worried about it. It's to other folks that uh, that I'm worried about. They they, uh, they just don't see think that it can happen, and a lot of them's going to be in for a big shock. I'm afraid. I've been warning people for years to prep because I knew this was coming. You know, uh, Scripture says uh, when God wants to judge a nation, He gives them over to wicked rulers. And I believe we're going to be falling under God's judgment. I believe we have for some time, but I think it's going to increase. Now, that's just my opinion. And, uh, you can agree or disagree. But uh, I think you better prep for hard times because they're coming. And if you're a Christian, believe the Bible, you know that they tell us that uh, in Scripture that... Uh, a day's wage for a loaf of bread. And I do believe we're in the end times. And uh, it's just going to increase this B system that we're in. But uh, that's just my little talk for today. I'll hush up and let you enjoy the scenery. get to prepare for your spiritual life too. Be close to God. If you're a Christian. And if you're not, I pray you will be before it's too late.
something like being out here in nature, seeing its splendor. I think it brings one closer to the Creator. I'm just an outdoor person. I like to hunt, fish, trap, bushcraft, forage. It's just good mental health, I think. It relaxes you. Take stress away. I did find some more flint. It's uh, Arkansas Blackstone that uh, is native here in the Washington Mountains region where I live. I did some research on it. They use it to sharpen knives and uh, all kinds of stuff. And she sparks pretty good, as you see. Thanks for watching this edition of Arkansas Wild Man Survival. And uh, God bless you. And I hope you have a good day today. I'm about ready for some uh, sausage biscuits and eggs for dinner. <laughs> Y'all have a good day. God bless you.